here. We will begin with questions. Uh, we'll start here with Jacob. Jacob, go ahead. Uh, thank you, Brian. Uh, Laura, just your normal thoughts on the match today. Uh, I think we obviously started off very poorly. Um, credit to them, I thought they were excellent. Um, we didn't have a response to that. We played ourselves into danger a lot. Didn't realise it quick enough. Um, obviously two goals of theirs come from mistakes from us. Um, but I'm not going to take anything away from them. I thought they, they were they were up for it, they were on the front foot. Um, they won first and second ball. They did all the things that you have to do in this league to be um, hard to beat. I think conceding early was tough, but even before the goal, we, we didn't start well. Um, and then I just said at half time they needed to make a choice whether we threw the game away or we, we tried to get back into it. And I thought in the second half, we dug in and we tried and we pushed. Um, didn't quite have quality throughout the whole game. Um, but you can't come in at 3 0 down and expect to be able to turn a game round. Thank you, Laura. Thanks, Jacob. And then we have Ayush right here in person. Hi, Laura. Ayush from Next Gen. My question is, um, during the first half and a little bit of the second, it seemed like a concerted effort from the rain to build through the left side, on which Lynn Williams was extremely effective in her pressing. What sort of strategy did you come up with to, to attack this? Honestly, we tried to play down both sides. I thought Lynn was uh, excellent in how she pressed. I thought we made it easier for, easy for her, to be honest, but um, it wasn't a strategy to go down the left. It wasn't a strategy last week to go down the right. Um, I think it's that's part of what we need to solve right now, is teams are trying to make us do things and we're falling into their trap. So I just said to the players, I think we have to regroup, we have to decide what we want to do. Uh, because over, obviously over the last two performances, and it's leaked into other performances, I think the, the sort of strategy that we're trying to put together um, isn't working. So we have to decide collectively what we want to do to solve that. Um, and obviously we've got two big games coming up at Hot Home to try and do that. Um, and one quick follow-up is the you know, extracurricular activity happening at 4-1. What were your thoughts on that? Well, what was that? Um, you know, the goal gets scored by us, oh, yeah. and then... Well, I, I, I'm unsure how someone takes a player out and doesn't get booked, and another player just tries to get the ball and does get booked. That, that was all I thought. Thanks, Ayush. And then Jada has a question. Uh, it's, the team appeared shell-shocked after the first goal. Do you agree with that? And what adjustments did you make at the break? It seemed the team played better in the second half. I'm not sure we were shell shocked from the goal. Honestly, I thought we were. I thought we just started really poorly, um, and we got punished. And this league is is tough, and that happens. Um, second half, we 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 showed up. Probably the best thing. Um, like I said, I, I asked them at half time. You have a choice. You can either go and fight and prove to the fans that that's not who we are. Or we can accept defeat and let the let the game go. And I thought we tried. I thought we put on a better performance in the second half. I thought we were sharper. I thought we looked like we um, wanted to compete a little bit more. Um, so yeah, we we definitely had a bit of a better second half. But the game was won at half time. All right, that's it for questions. Thanks, Laura.